Hey friends, this is kind of fun because I just picked up a General's Kimberly 9XXB pencil. They're fatter than the traditional Kimberly. You can see that, how much bigger they are and fatter, which I'm really not crazy about, but whatever. I've got the Pentel cap erasers on these. I really love these uh, polymer, high polymer cap erasers. From so I've done some comparison here. Typically I use an 8B and that's over here. Also done some variations in line uh, pressure so you can see right through my comparisons here. So that's the 8B, which I typically use for sketching, you know, in my art books. You know, that's what I use, like this stuff is with the 8B pencil. It's kind of my go-to. It's a lot of fun. It's a great shade from General's Kimberly. And then the 9B, 9XXB, which is right here. I do not have the 9B yet. My local art supply store that's back ordered, but I'll be doing a follow-up video review on that one as well. That comes in apparently at the normal diameter of the traditional General's Kimberly, but the 9XXB is really fat. So that's this right here. You can see there's there's somewhat difference between that and the uh, 8B. What it is, is that this has got a charcoal component to it, without a doubt. And also the 8B, see how that shines there with the graphite? Now check this out. See how the 9XXB does not shine as much, not nearly as much. That really shows it right there. See that in the light. So if you're looking for a um, non-shine, the 9XB is a little better for that. A little bit darker. But then this is where it really gets interesting for me. Um, I really love the charcoal pencils from Generals. And here's the hard HB, and then next to that is the 2B medium. And you can really see just such a rich difference, you know, moving over to the charcoal pencils versus either one of these graphites to the left. I mean, it's just a much richer line. Now, what I'm saving the video for to show you guys live here is how these things erase because that's really important, you know, to touch up our drawings. So with the 8B, I'm just going to go in here and do some um, eraser work. You know, this the 8B cleans up really nicely, real nicely. Let's move over to the 9XXB. Right away, I noticed that this does not clean up the same as the 8B. And it's due to, it's not bad, but it's due to that... Um, charcoal component in the pencil not bad though and you know certainly workable now with the general's hb hard i mean that cleans up actually as well as the 9xxb kind of surprised about that of course you know there's more of a slightly more of a smudge factor getting into the charcoal pencil but really not that huge of a difference and the medium charcoal let's just do a little bit of eraser work in there as well you can see that this pentel man i'm telling you if you dig cap erasers please go get yourself this one because this is the real deal and because it's that uh, more higher polymer it really grabs in it's it's very uh, hard with charcoal and just how wonderful it is for a painterly you know, effect. Here's the 8B. Let's check out the smudge factor here with these very um, gradient lines here that I've made down there. And then the 9XB, this has got a little bit of that charcoal, so I'm anticipating more smudging. Really not that bad. Really not different, hardly at all, from the 8B. See the smudge factor there? Let's move over to the General's HB hard smudge factor with my finger. Yeah, definitely some more smudging, but man, it's just such a great pencil, the hard. I mean, the more I use this tool, it's like, you know, you're kind of getting the best of the both worlds with kind of graphite action versus uh, and performance versus non-smudge. Here's the medium generals. Definitely more of a smudge factor there. You can see that. There's the hard next to it. The 9XXB. 
and the 8B even smudges. You know, they all smudge, of course. Definitely going to get more of that into the medium. But what do you guys think? Post your comments below if you've enjoyed this General's Graphite and Charcoal Pencil comparison, getting into the soft pencils. That's what I like to draw with all the time. I mean, that's what I'm using. This is actually a General's HB Primo that I did the other day on some cream colored paper. And, um, you know, you can use a nice fixative with this stuff too, which is what I use for finished work. Well, I love drawing black and white with graphite and charcoal pencil. And, you know, the graphite really is um, the most expeditious and least smudgy. You still get a nice dark line with either of these. I think for my money, though, I'd stick with the 8B just because I like the narrower uh, diameter. And I'm going to wait to get the 9B in this diameter because this pencil is just too chunky for me. I I'm just not psyched about that. If there was a huge marked difference in the darkness of this pencil, I may be more forgiving that it's so much fatter. But it's really not that much darker. And... For a similar diameter, actually even less diameter, I would just go into the General's charcoal pencils, you know, and get the real charcoal performance like you see there. Post your comments below, please, about your favorite soft pencil, whether it's graphite or charcoal. Thanks for watching, you guys. I look forward to reading your comments below.